to Germany's economic success and how exactly have they educated their students to meet the demands of the workplace? Uh, I would say it is extremely important, not only for Germany, but for any country, to have a strong education base because there's a strong connection between the technical skills of the population and, say, for example, the manufacturing sector, which you know drives economies like uh, Germany or let's say other developed countries. And so Germany has realized that that if they want to prosper over the years, they have to have a strong education system. And unfortunately, this is where I think we are falling behind. If you look at the US, uh, if you look at what has happened in Wisconsin, or if you look at what has happened in a number of other states, instead of basically uh, encouraging education system, we have cut government funding to education. We have basically discouraged education in every different possible way. Uh, unless we put more emphasis on education, unless we uh, try to teach our students you know, the technical skills that they need, uh, we will have problems down the road because we are now living in a globalized economy and other countries are emphasizing education. If we don't, then we will fall behind. Uh, in the coming years. Ken in Milwaukee, hi. Hi, good morning. Thank you for, very much for this program. You're welcome. Um, I'm an executive and te technical recruiter, and um, I'm wondering how has Germany, both in their industry and government, dealt with people who are long-term unemployed, who are older? Uh, what has been the policies on both sides as far as the age discrimination? Because this is an unspoken 